Welcome to the Maritime and Coast Guard Agency video news podcast, bringing you the latest stories from around the UK's coasts. This month, we take a look at the MCA spotter plane patrolling the Dover Strait, and the teams in Scotland keeping our mountains safe. The following footage was taken from the BBC programme, Britain from Above. And out in the channel, great container ships are making for our ports. High above, the Dover Coast Guard's spotter planes taking to the air. At the controls are pilot Craig Brearley, and behind him sits spotter Bill Watson. They're monitoring the busiest shipping lane in the world, the English Channel. On a typical day, more than 400 ships pass through the straits off Dover. With the biggest vessels weighing over 100,000 tonnes and taking three and a half miles to come to a stop, there's a real risk of collision. But all these ships are following a route laid out by the British Coast Guard. An invisible maritime motorway designed to avert disaster on the high seas. Any vessel over 300 tonnes is tracked automatically by satellite. Here we can see the GPS traces of 24 hours worth of shipping as it passes through the channel. Streams of southbound vessels pass up the English side, northbound ships hug the French. And in between, countless ferries dodge across the straits into Dover. No other shipping lane is so busy that it has these rules of the road. Bill and Craig's job is to swoop out of the sky and alert or identify any ship that might be breaking them. And I keep him in sight so I can set myself up nicely to run down his side. And then both men will, will start scanning it for all the details. Speed back to 90 knots. And these rules are strictly enforced. Slip out of the right lane and courtesy of Bill and Craig, the Coast Guard could be sending you a traffic fine of thousands of pounds. The island of Skye, on the west coast of Scotland. The Sky Mountain Rescue Team are on exercise. Their task? To practice picking up an injured climber from a 2,000 foot high crag in what is perhaps the wildest and most untamed corner of Britain. As the helicopter closes in, so does the weather. Swirling rain clouds cut visibility to yards. It's no easier on the ground. This mountainside is formed from crystallized volcanic lava, sharp enough to cut a climber's hands to ribbons. The rocks produce so much magnetic interference, compasses are useless. You don't mock nature round here. So extreme is this landscape, rescue teams like this are out on call almost every day of the year. 